It's important to view knowledge as a sort of semantic tree. Make sure you understand the fundamental principles, the trunk and the branches, before you get into the leaves, details, or there is nothing for them to hang on to. Elon Musk. Hey everyone, welcome to Quotes to Live By. I'm John Timmerman. I absolutely love this quote by Elon Musk. This is a great quote that describes a fantastic way to learn anything. And that's the basic concept is that Elon Musk uses to, he founded and launched SpaceX, Tesla, um, the Boring Company is his holding company. Um, he's Solar City, I think is the other company. So he's in all of these different air industries, the, uh, the Hyperloop, these, all these different innovative industries, and he's doing them successfully, you know? On a grand scale, he learns these different things. And it starts uh, with this concept of thinking of an industry or something new you need to learn, like a tree. It starts with the roots. You need to learn the basics before you go up the trunk and before you expo uh, expect to branch out into the details, right? So let's take something very basic like concepts like marketing or finance or operations, right? Or you could take the industry. So I'm learning the restaurant industry right now. I have no experience in the restaurant industry other than being a dishwasher uh, when I was like 16 years old. So learning the restaurant and the food industry. I had to learn the consumer packaged goods industry. I had to learn Amazon in order to effectively work on our, our clients' accounts at Good Monster. And so I love this quote because it describes it a fast and efficient way to learn anything. Start with the basics. The basics of marketing are that marketing it starts with a brand. You know, you need to build your brand in order for people to respond to any sort of marketing and advertising you do. There needs to be a message. There needs to be a mission. And one of the most basic concepts of marketing is to encourage social proof or word of mouth. Uh, and so that means you need to make sure that if somebody sees your brand, a Nike symbol, that's a bad example because everybody knows Nike, but somebody sees your logo that uh, they're going to respond to it in a certain way. They're going to be sucked in. And then eventually they're going to see that there's other people who have already tried your brand out, your product out, that like your brand. And so it, it makes it okay for them to as well, right? So this is a basic concept of marketing. Now you can take that basic concept. And once you understand that reviews and testimonials and case studies and your friends or your neighbors having that same product and loving it is what fuels a lot of marketing in today's day and age, and did 20, 30, 40, 50 years ago as well, just was in word of mouth. Uh, once you understand that concept, now you can go and find ways to build that social proof. Reviews, Google reviews, Yelp reviews, TripAdvisor reviews, Amazon reviews, uh, uh, customer reviews on Shopify, wherever you might find them, right? Um, case studies. So case studies showing effective client work for B2B businesses or even B2C businesses, a case study. Any industry can create a case study. Video reviews and testimonials. All of these ways are the branches off of social proof. Influencers, that's another type of social proof. If an influencer is using a product and recommending it, you probably should too. So this concept of starting with the trunk and the big branches and understanding that before you go and try to figure out how to negotiate pay for an influencer will lead you to a successful launch. But if you try to skip the roots, you try to skip the trunk and go straight to the details, you're going to miss so much and you're going to make so many mistakes. So it's a fantastic quote by Elon Musk. If you're learning something new or you want to, start with the basic concepts and do not skip past them until you fully understand them. One more piece that I'm going to leave is why this is so important, especially as an entrepreneur or a leader, is that you need to understand the basic concepts in order to outsource or hire somebody who is going to work on the details. Because if you don't understand the concepts, you'll never be able to measure the work that they're doing and making sure that it's effective and efficient and working towards remarkable results for you. Like and subscribe to this podcast if you found it valuable.